All right, here I am demonstrating my, um, my fuzz pedal that I'm going to be uh, selling here soon. This is what I call the rude face, and as you can see, it's, uh, it's a face. And I mean that in two different ways, because this is a light, or this is a clone of a fuzz face. There's a, a little bit of a modification for more output that I've um, included. Gives it a little more output, a little fatter of a sound, and it'll allow it to oscillate, which will which does an interesting effect, and um, I'll get to that later. But for now, I'll show you how this thing sounds clean. I'm running my uh, Relic Squire Strat into my vintage Gibson Explorer amp, which has been heavily modified. Uh, this, this thing has GFS vintage Alnico Staggers pickups in it. The Strat is, that is, not the amp. Hiccups in an amp would do nothing, obviously. So, um, sounds like a strat. Sounds like a nice strat. Excuse my sloppy playing there. So, I've got this thing at about, um, I don't know, 10 o'clock, 9 o'clock, something like that. Fuzz is straight up. And I'll just begin to show you how this sounds. So this is more of a light fuzz setting. This is not as smooth as it gets. Fairly quiet for a fuzz pedal. That's in that uh, that noiseless fourth position um, that's so famous on strats. Uh, of course, reverse revamp, reverse wound, reverse polarity makes it noiseless. So here's the neck pickup. Go straight on down to the bridge pickup. So that gives you an idea of what it sounds like in that position. Now, as I crank up the volume, leaving the fuzz the same, keep in mind I'm running into a tube amp. So this thing is set up so that even clean, I got a little bit of dirt in there. Which to me is the best setting for uh, fuzz because just straight fuzz kind of sounds like a broken solid state amp. So here's with the volume up a little. what that sounds like. Now I'm going to show you a crazy setting. So this one involves taking the fuzz, turning it all the way up, and then growing a pair of balls and turning this volume up all the way too. And you'll notice at first it ain't going to be pretty. I have to have my guitar's volume on to do this. Now you notice that weird farting sound? That that's the oscillation I was telling you about. But if you get there and then you back it off a bit, it gets into this weird noiseless area. Now my, my guitar's volume is all the way up right now. Fuzz is maxed out, volume is maxed out. This thing's pushing the input stage of my amp hard and like max fuzziness here. But it's quiet. Even in the neck pickup, I can make it quiet. And it's this weird thing where the oscillation is kind of made this noise canceling situation. So uh, I'll show you here. And 
it goes back to being just that quiet. And that's in the neck pickup, which is uh, crazy for an overdrive sound. Yeah, you, know, you could go. I can just show you how much gain we've got going on here. Those are the springs in the back of the strap here. So you can go straight into like Foxy Lady. that was uh, really sloppy but now let me show you what I'm talking about about the noiseless thing now you might be saying well it's just pretty quiet right now well check this out if I back off the volume that's what I'm talking about now if I keep backing off the volume it goes away ain't that crazy I can even turn the fuzz up now. And that of course is uh... It's feeding back with my pickups because it's really uh, a lot of gain. But I'll show you a bit of this. this fuzz a bit again and when you crank back the fuzz you can turn the volume back up again or get some Billy Idol uh, all right I've already rambled on long enough now um, I'll show you, see if I can get a uh, the clean through a fuzz face sound, kind of like you see Hendrix playing with a lot live. All right, so we're um, we're actually on the fuzz face, as you can see, got an indicator light, which is something real fuzz faces don't have. Um, I have my strats position at two. Do some all along the watchtower. <laughs>
my apologies for the horrible playing today, but uh, this is my fuzz face. That's how it sounds. Uh, hopefully you're judging by how it sounds, not how I'm playing. Um, but hopefully you'll hear the pedal in this, and I think it sounds awesome. Um, oh, I know what I was going to say. This is a silicon transistor fuzz face. These are not germanium transistors. Uh, they're BC-108s, in case you're a fuzz face nerd and you know what that means. So that's like the, um, the silicon era fuzz faces, which are the blue ones. You see, those are the silicon ones. The red ones are the germanium. Um, Hendrix used the blue ones towards the end of his career. Yeah, they think, and the, uh, the Hendrix signature fuzzes use BC-108s. That's what I was going for. I like Jimmy, so I was kind of going for that sound. But uh, that's that. Hope you like it. Oh, the other thing I didn't mention, we have power on the side. Um, let me show you how that works. It's just your standard um, Boss 2.1 millimeter, millimeter um, power plug, like you have for all your Boss pedals. Let's see if I got that plugged in right. So I have my uh, fuzz face in, lights on, plug in my plug. All right, uh, sorry about that. I um, forgot to plug the power supply into the wall. So here it is, you see you plug it in. Indicator lights on and everything's golden. I already switched out my amp so I can't show you how it sounds, but well, here I'll show you. And there you go. That's the uh, rude face fuzz pedal. That's how it sounds. That's how it looks. That's how it works. Good stuff.